Welcome to the story of my life. At least I think it happened this way. Or maybe it was that other thing. Honestly, if I'm going to have a past, I prefer it to be multiple choice. <laughs> but I digress. Enjoy Nightwing's full walkthrough of Batman Arkham Origins. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Well, enjoy the show, and remember, I'll be watching. Hey, what's happening, gamers? Welcome back to Batman Arkham Origins. And we're going off to see Garfield Lins, a.k.a. Firefly. And uh, if you're new to our channel, we like to do lore and also goof off and uh, try to do a walkthrough. So we're going to do a bit of both. Wait, we do walkthroughs too? Oh, what, okay. What is, what is this walkthrough? Oh, we I also... I forgot. We also play the game. We also play the game, yes. You do. Well, I do. You just sit there and look pretty so people can't see you. So they kind of... You know what? We're just going to do this fast travel. Skip this. Let's go to the stupid bridge. Hate you, bridge. Bridge too far. Anyway, yeah. um, the Firefly is real name, at least in this game, and uh, originally is Garfield Lins. He first appeared in Detective Comics number 184, and he was created by France Heroin, or Heron, and Dick Sprang. He's affiliated with the Society, an expert in pyrotechnics and explosives. And he's only been portrayed in animation in the uh, fourth season of Batman, the animated series, also known as the New Adventures of Batman, Superman, or um, Gotham Dark Knight, I think, as it's called in Europe, or something like that. Or Gotham Knights. I'm not sure what it's called. So, yeah. And w what's really interesting about Garfield Lens, which I'll talk about a little bit later, um, the character is pretty funny for one thing as he never seems to get out of jail once he's in there he doesn't get out he's, not, <laughs> he's in he's, there forever he, yeah he's not a rogue that you normally see like out and about although what's funny is uh in arkham asylum in arkham city he has apparently um on the lamb like he's disappeared mm. because they have some of his stuff in arkham asylum like in the first game and uh, there's some clippings about him in mm -hmm. Arkham City, but that's it. Wow, like, he actually got out of jail then. He got out of jail and he didn't get rearrested. Amazing. Amazing indeed. I love listening to the thugs. It's so cool. Yeah. But no. I yeah. Um. I need to draw Firefly away from the bridge so I can approach safely. I still think those thugs would be on their cell phones or playing a game or something like they talk a lot it's weird why is batman spasming is it going i have no idea there he is oh he's also obsessed with fire yep. explosions he's, he's like yeah he has pyromania or shows signs of it just one of those stinking pigs on this bridge which Batman's using the Batwing to distract Firefly, it looks like. Yeah, I think that means he gets like a high out of setting stuff on fire. I've got to stop him before he sends his men into yeah, no, people don't like it when we talk through the cutscenes, apparently, because we're evil. We're so evil. Yeah. It's like, they don't want to play the game, they just want to, you know, whatever. No, I understand. We do our best, but we don't like being interrupted when we're speaking. Because it's like, you can't shut off this fountain of knowledge, because once you do, you can't get it back. Yeah. It's like the code that you don't have. Ouch. <laughs> no, 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 somebody's got a gun. Of course the cop has a gun. Why wouldn't the cop have a gun? Standard oh. issue. Why can't they use pepper spray instead? Or like, I don't know. No, they need guns, because otherwise... The criminals have nothing to be afraid of. They could be afraid of them wearing, like, matching uniforms. Isn't that kind no. of creepy? Yeah, Alright, that's it. Of... Actually, I remember you talking... I don't know, I was talking about that with you, because they're actually developing this electric gun that just stuns people, kind of like a... Um, stun gun. Stun gun, you know, like, a, right now, like a taser. You can only taser someone from so many feet. But they're developing this taser that you can shoot long range. It's like a taser bullet that shoots at you. 
Batman, stop it. But, Just climb this stupid wall. But yeah, it's like, even if they developed that, I mean, that would be great, but it is good for, I think, policemen still to have lethal force. Oh, I, I agree. Policemen should still carry. Because the bad guys aren't going to show restraint. Yeah. Exactly. This is true. Bullock. He said Harvey, so it is Harvey Bullock. Yay! Don't send in your men. Firefly has the bridge rigged with explosives. Show yourself! You have a go! No! Call them back. If Firefly blows the bridge, there's no telling how many will die. You're the reason those people are in danger. He's doing this for the bounty on your head! Give yourself up! I'm going to bring in Firefly myself. Don't send anyone else in until I tell you it's safe. You'll stay the hell out of this! You hear me? <laughs> Why doesn't Gordon just come out of that little room and arrest me? Yeah, Gordon's being Brandon, mean. Brandon, Everybody says I'm saying his name wrong. Commissioner Gordon, or excuse me, Captain Gordon just said, Brendan, Brendan. Brandon, okay. What? How do we say his name? Oh, we've, we've been saying it the way the game calls him, because that's his name. SWAT, SWAT officer Brendan. No one else goes in without my yeah, but I think they spell it wrong in the um, the subtitles, because he was Brendan in the last game, but they're spelling it Brandon. No, Brendan. Brendan is behind bars in um, in the uh, other Arkham games. He's not an officer anymore. He's a bad cop. You're you're just remembering him from um, the Batman Year One movie. Oh. Commissioner Loeb's right hand man. Hmm. Okay. Headphone, headbutt. Oops. Oops. Yeah, so it's kind of weird. It seems like Firefly just loses his job and goes to poverty and then yes. somehow... He decides to become a criminal. A reason <laughs> to become a supervillain is just because he's in poverty. It's like, oh, I'll become... You know, I'm going to become a, a bad criminal. guy. But he... Yeah, like... Oh. I guess his original story, the pre-crisis story, he's really good with lighting effects. Can, we, can we just stop saying pre-crisis? Because now it's confusing. Now it's pre-52 and modern whatever. age and new 52. Well, okay, his we'll go first age. backstory, whatever well, what, it is. He came out in the 1950s, right? Yeah. So he'd be golden age. So he just uses optical illusions a lot. and. So he's like Marvel's Mysterio. A little bit. And then later on... Minus the fishbowl hat. His next uh, backstory is where he's he enjoys setting things on fire, and he uses a lot of fire, and then eventually he burns himself. Yeah, I know. That's that's what they call irony. Yeah. He's like, <laughs> Those he's who like live I by am fire. Firefly. I like fire. Fire so burned now, me horribly. Yeah, he's suffered. He has suffered. 90% of his body has been burnt. Oh, that's got to suck. Well, yeah. now we know why he wears that getup. And then after that, he was sent to Blackgate Prison, so it's like... <laughs> that, that's awesome. I thought they don't usually put people in jail until after they've recovered. I hope he recovers. I was saying that. Like, I hope I hope all of his... I'm not going to go into the And, and we thought, well, you are you were a medical assistant yeah, or a nurse or something. Yeah, but you'd have to, like, so, grow yeah. back some of them, yeah. Just be like... I don't want to talk person. about it, No, yeah. don't talk about it. <laughs> don't talk about it anymore. But it'd be gross. Stop it! Stop where you are. <laughs> yeah, let's not go there. <laughs> let's not go there. We're not gonna do this now. But um, his name is from when Batman and Robin were trying to stop him. Um, mm -hmm. They mistook a firefly for his cigarette, or the other way around. Okay. And then he thought, oh, that's kind of cool, and then he calls himself the firefly. That makes sense. Um, I never yeah. like one of these guards tell me how many bombs Firefly has and where they are. The only reason I remember Firefly is from the Batgirl Year One like remake, which was really well done. Okay. Where he was uh, basically Killer Moth's sidekick, but the sidekick stepped up Ron Possible style. Oh, okay. Batman, what are you doing? Batman, what are you doing? Why, why are you failing, Batman? I'm sorry. I said something wrong. No! <laughs> Aww. 
Oh, they're penguin gargoyles. No. What? Or some kind of gargoyle. Oh wait, those are claws? What are those that you're on? Why are you sneaking Weird. around like that? Why am I sneaking around like what? I didn't do nothing. You can't prove nothing. What can you prove? But yeah, he was um, his protege of Killer Moth for a while. Until Killer Moth was scared of how crazy he really was. Oh yeah, Garfield Lens is insane. I mean, that, that's without a doubt. He's, he's completely lost his mind. But, I mean, he lost his job. He lost everything. Yeah. So, that's, that's really... Sometimes, yeah, I guess poverty can do that. Especially if you're working so hard and nothing is happening. It's just like, yeah, it can probably make you go insane sometimes. Sneak, sneak, sneak. I don't know if I decide to be a supervillain who burns stuff, but... <laughs> yeah, because uh, sooner or later... <laughs> you get burnt you yourself. You get burnt yourself, yeah. Yeah. And I think the, um, the interesting time where in the Nightfall story where he... I don't understand why, but he's trying to burn all the places he never went as a child in Gotham. But yeah, like, I always found that kind of I don't weird. understand, like, was he mad he didn't get to go there because he was poor when he was a kid or something? I have no idea. I'll have to read the comic to know, but... But Batman captured him um, at the third site before he was able to burn down the Gotham Zoo. <laughs> what does he have wrong with the zoo? It's a zoo. It's a zoo for children. Yeah. Apparently, he never got to go. So let's destroy it for everyone. That makes so much sense. Well, then no one will be happy. <laughs> no, but yeah, uh, Batgirl yeah. Year One, it's, if you guys can find it, it is an amazing novel. And in fact, they even have a digital comic of it on Amazon and Hulu. And I strongly recommend mm, cool. uh, you watch it because it's pretty fantastic. It, it shows um, uh, both the uh, romance for uh, Batgirl and Robin, too, kind of. Aww. Like that little playfulness. Crap. I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> I did not mean to do that. I totally messed up the whole stealth element of this. Okay, okay, I can't I believe you, Batman. Well, Batman's still learning, so we'll... I didn't die, either. Wait, that so guy I mean, surrendered to you? Yeah, he's gonna be interrogated. He wants to be lifted up in the air and beat up. One here, one directly above us, in the bridge sublevel, and one more at each end of the bridge. Those are the big ones. That's all of them. I promise. Then I promise you a good night's sleep. Oh, he's gonna <sighs> knock him. Yeah. Yeah, of course he's gonna knock him out. Cause like, how can he trust him to walk around? Yeah, you just told me vital information. Uh, you can walk around. No, I'm sorry. <laughs> you can't. You need to be knocked out. Yeah. Boom. Totally. No, but back row, you're one. On the bridge. With the largest bombs at each end, I'll need to disarm this bomb before going after the others. Garfield Lynn showed how crazy he was because there were two imposters of Killer Moth and, um, like, uh, himself, and they kidnapped. I for, I'm trying to remember who they kidnapped. They kidnapped, I believe it was Batgirl and Black Canary, I think. Mm -hmm. And at least I think Black Canary was in that story. I can't remember. Um, and. They, like, Firefly caught up with them and the fake killer moth and they basically took the hostages back, but at the same time, they he killed their doppelgangers. Like, he just burned them alive and, like, nearly burned ah. down, like, this mobster's house. And then, you know, Firefly, or excuse me, Killer Moth was just like, I'm done with you. You're insane. And, you know, uh, Firefly was just like, oh, no, you can't stop now. We're in this for the long haul, partner. So Killer Moth was kind of stuck with him, and they both ended up being taken down by Batman and Robin and Batgirl, like on a helicopter, which is it was pretty cool in the digital comic. Originally, a Bruce Timm and company planned on doing a Batgirl Year One um, movie, but unfortunately, it got canceled along with that the Judas contract. That would have been awesome. Yeah, would have been pretty cool. Been pretty amazing. I think I'm supposed to go this way. Yeah, this looks like what I'm supposed to do. Yeah. Main elevator hall. Well, I have here um, kind of what Firefly is equipped with. 
He obviously is an expert in pyrotechnics and explosive and explosives and he can kind of use stuff around him. And then he has an insulated battle suit equipped with a flamethrower, grenade launchers, and wings that allow him to fly. Yep. Pretty cool. And he has a weird looking face t helmet thing that makes him look, look weird. Like, look like a, a bug. Yeah, and he's been a member of the Secret Society of Supervillains. And he's also, he's worked with different people, including Black Mask hired him at one point. Oops. What am I doing wrong? Oh, Black Mask hired him to place chips in Gothamites in order to make them burn. Oh, jeez. People, I don't know, random people. Yeah, I mean, he seems like he's kind of insane and not a nice a little guy. This is a little insane. Um, he was in the Arrow show. Green Arrow? The new Depicted as a former firefighter. Yeah, the show Error. Arrow. The show Error. <laughs> He's yeah. in the show Error. Yeah. Oh, the sparkler guys. I hate the sparkler guys. I don't have to be the sparkler guys. I mean, come on. Ugh. I got yeah. nothing when it comes to sparkler people. But yeah, and he was also in Batman Brave and the Bold, and yeah. Wait, he was in Brave and the Bold? I don't remember that. Yes, he was. Are you sure he wasn't in the Batman? I think you're getting them confused. No, Batman Brave and the Bold. Really? And he was also in the Batman. Well, the Batman, he had a different... He had kind of like a Batman animated series origin a little bit. Like where he was the, uh, you know, boyfriend of this, like, really popular pop singer. Oh, yeah. And, they, uh, and he messed up on her... They messed up, so she on fired her, him. On her lighting stuff, on her mm -hmm. concert. It was never Sionis. The Joker put up the bounty, and now he's behind bars. I heard, but I still got a score to settle with you. I'm giving you the rest of the night off. He <laughs> punched him in the face. That was awesome. Uh... Oh, it should also be noted that Batgirl did not, um, in Batgirl Year One, she didn't dress up. An oath to uphold the law. When I see you again, I expect you to be following that oath to the letter. Yes, yes, sir. I'm sorry. She didn't like dress up as Batgirl to become a vigilante. She dressed up like for a costume party as like a Batman-like character, and then ended up like uh, saving Bruce Wayne and her father's life. Like, mm. and just, I don't know, I guess she just kept on doing it. And Robin and her had this kind of thing going, which was really funny, because Batman's like, you know, I don't want another person on the team. And Robin would actually drop her little things, like gifts, smoke Aww. bombs, batarangs, binoculars, like special rope so that her hands won't get ripped when she's swinging. Oh, cool. Oh, yeah, I remember you talk telling me about that before. It's pretty amazing. I didn't know that was from, so... Yeah, that was from back when you were. That would have been awesome to make a movie of that. Oh, hostages. No, I don't want to get blown up. Yeah, don't tell Firefly about the zoo. I are baboons. He'll try to burn it. I wouldn't. S Help! Crap! Oh, that was dumb. Dumb, 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 dumb. Why can I not sneak up behind people today? Well, at least I get to break a wall. Yay! Breaking walls is fun. Hey, it feels so good to yeah take someone by surprise. I bet Batman secretly smiles really big when he takes someone down. Well, he hasn't really Just don't enjoyed see this it. yet. There's no fun in this. Wait till he gets uh, Grayson. That'd be some fun. Yeah. Wow, this guy's easily spooked. I'm going to get you out of there. 
Yeah, that's gonna happen. Um, is he gonna climb up the ladder? Stay calm and stay quiet. And then there was one. Boo. Wait, what just happened? Bomb blew up already? Well, that's good. They probably thought they were gonna blow up, but they didn't. I'm not sure, but he sure beat the hell out of those goons. I've heard about him. He's a criminal, wanted by the cops. Just I'm no more criminal than you are. Don't be stupid. Why would he do what he just did if he wasn't here to help? If you're so sure, that's a point. So apparently I need to get to a control room. Oof. Mm -hmm. Reflux, not fun. <laughs> Ugh. I found the control room. Hey for me. I don't know. I was kind of curious what Batman would sound like when he said he ate me. Oh, Interesting, I just am reading something really interesting about Firefly in the animated series. Um, the producers wanted to use Firefly earlier on in Batman the animated series. Yeah, but Bruce Tim like Firefly. They, they were forbidden by Fox to use any pyromaniac character. Oh, sadness. Denied. Well, I mean, it makes sense because kids are easily influenced. I remember in the 90s there was this big thing against, like, you know, fire safety and things like that. Yeah. There was like, there was all this stuff. Like, I don't know why, but I, yeah. When I think of Firefly, we, yeah. Yeah, we met someone who had issues with that. So oh, I, can, I, can I tell the story? I don't know. No? I guess we, you can. We went to college with a guy who burned down several churches. <sighs> and he was the nicest guy in the know. world. We but we no didn't idea. even know. That must be the we didn't know. I, I let him borrow my X-Men DVDs, and we drove him back to see his parents. Yeah, that's what it did it, the X-Men DVD, no. Blame Magneto! And the brother no, but he had already done it when yeah. we were driving with him. The bomb at the south end. Have this door open <laughs> I remember, I remember that, yeah. He was really nice, like, we were getting along a lot, we were like, oh my gosh, this guy's so much fun. He likes watching all the same stuff we do. And Oops, cutscene, sorry. Sorry. codes to get past it. Police should have access to those codes. Perhaps Captain Gordon. Gordon won't cooperate. I'm heading to get the other bomb. Get those codes to me by the time I'm done. I need to wait for Alfred to find the codes for this door. In the meantime, there's still one more bomb I can disarm. How dare you talk through our story? Yeah, yeah how, how dare you? So yeah, the K-Wings um, have done some pretty interesting things over the no, years. No, we, we, yeah, it was interesting. But I remember you thought something was up because he was like, oh, he had these, like, one of those things for the grill, like, special he was bringing, He was bringing back home, like, Like those, a bunch of them, A bunch though, of those, like, like, kerosene things. Yeah, and you were like, whoa, so you like fire, huh? And he kind of was like, yeah. And it's like, I guess some people are just obsessed about it, but mm -hmm. don't, just, the moral of the story is that guy went to jail, and I'm pretty sure he's still in jail, so. Yeah, he's still in prison. Just don't burn stuff down for fun, kids or adults, because it doesn't end well. Yeah. <laughs> you don't want to go to jail for something stupid. Yeah, totally. But uh, on that note, um, we're actually going to end this episode. We'll be back with more uh, Firefly next time as we try to disarm the bombs. Uh, thanks so much for taking the time to watch. We hope you guys have enjoyed yourself. Uh, I'm pretty sure I just got lost because that's what I tend to do. Um, so we'll pick up uh, where we're supposed to be going next. Have an awesome rest of your day, and in the comments section below, tell us what you think of Garfield Lens. We'll be back with more lore and more fun next time. See ya. Oops, that's it for this episode, kiddies. Join us tomorrow, same bat time, same bat channel. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Be seeing you soon. <laughs>
Ha 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 